In this video, I want to demonstrate how we would calculate the percent ionization of water. We know that all water undergoes the process of auto-ionization, which is basically just the reaction of two water molecules between themselves uh, to produce a hydronium ion and a, hydro and a hydroxide ion. Um, and you can calculate the percent ionization of water from information that um, that you that you as a chemistry student should be very familiar with. And we're going to assume that um, that this will be at standard conditions, so standard temperature and pressure. All right, so this is the equilibrium for the auto ionization of water. As I said, two molecules of liquid water uh, react in in equilibrium with a hydronium ion and a hydroxide ion. And just from this equilibrium, uh, we know that pure water will have a pH of 7.00, which corresponds to a, hydro to a hydronium ion concentration of 1.0 times 10 to the negative 7 moles per liter. And we also know that the density of water is equal to 1.00 gram per cubic centimeter. And the conversion factor between liters and cubic centimeters is 1 liter is equal to 1,000 cubic centimeters. So with, so with this information, we can now calculate the percent ionization of water. And if, and if we remind ourselves what percent ionization is, Percent ionization is just equal to the concentration of the ionized species, in this case the hydronium ion, or the hydroxide ion, it doesn't matter which one you use, because they're in a one-to-one -one ratio. Um, but it will be the, the percent ionization will be equal to the um, concentration of the hydronium ion divided by the the total number of moles of water in one liter times 100 percent. So we already know the concentration of the hydronium ion. Um, so we just have to determine the number of moles of water in one liter. And, and uh, we'll, we'll determine that using the density and the conversion factors listed here. So the moles of water in one liter is equal to, um, so we have one gram of water per one cubic centimeter, which is the density of water, times one mole of water um, for 18.02 grams of water, which is the molar mass of water. And that ends up giving us um, units of moles of water per one cubic centimeter. And then we use the conversion factor to change that into units of moles per liter. And once we do that, we'll end up with a value of 55.5 moles per liter. So in one liter, there are 55.5 moles of water. So now, uh, with that value, we can very easily calculate percent ionization. So percent ionization will be equal to concentration of the hydronium ion, 1 decimal zero times uh, 1 decimal zero times 10 to the negative 7 moles per liter. divided by 55.5 moles per liter times 100%, which gives us a value of 1.8 times 10 to the negative 7 percent ionization.
of water.